Today for Mouse Trap Monday, we're gonna test out this vintage live catch trap called the Black Beauty. It is a nice looking trap, and it claims it can catch a lot of different pests, including roaches, water bugs, mice, and crickets. There's a cartoon of some cats here, and they say, sure, we object to the Black Beauty traps. They are catching all the mice schmucks. No poison to set, directions on back. These are the kittens that play in the house that Jack built. And it's made by Durbin Durko Inc. of St. Louis, Missouri. The Durbin company has been around for a long time, since 1938. And over the years, they've made a wide variety of products, including pulleys, chain binders, and many other items, including a ring that fits in a bull's nose so you can lead them around. And they really like the name Black Beauty. They also made a Black Beauty corn sheller. So with the wide variety of products they made over the years, it's not surprising they made a mouse trap. And like many other items, they called it Black Beauty. It says combination roach, water bug, cricket, and mouse trap. It's magnetic. Let's see, it says bait the trap with slices of banana half an inch thick. Bread with honey, syrup, or beer. Or raw potatoes or onions. Onions? I don't know if that makes a good bait. Place under the sink where you see roaches, water bugs, kill insects by pouring. So they say the bottom just pops off here. And as you can see, this is a dome with a little one-way door. Now I'm not infested with water bugs or crickets or roaches, but I did go to the pet store and bought some crickets and cockroaches. It's kind of crazy to think of buying cockroaches, but we want to test it out. I'll go put them on here and see if they drop down. Here's my pack of spotted roaches. These make great reptile food, but I don't have any lizards to feed. We're gonna put them on here and see if they drop down. The cockroach is actually kind of cute, but I wouldn't want them in my house. We'll put him and his friends on the trap. Well, the black beauty works for roaches. There's a few hanging out on the opening, but there's quite a few down in the bottom. Let's see if the crickets will go in. I got some house crickets from the pet store. Who we got that one. The black beauty trap worked great for roaches and crickets. Now I couldn't find any live water bugs. I have a water bug here. It's pretty big, but I think it would fit down the hole and get caught. Let's see if our black fox mouse will go in the black beauty trap. Well, that didn't take long. He checked out the hole, went down in there, and got caught. This worked really well with our pet mice. Let's go set it up in the shop and see if we can get wild mice. We'll go put him back in his cage. Thanks for the help. Last night we set up this vintage live catch black beauty mouse trap in the shop and we caught two deer mice. They wanted the sunflower seeds dropped through the hole and this is like the Hotel California. Once you enter you can't leave. With the funnel they couldn't find their way out. So this trap worked really well on small rodents. Because it's a live catch trap and these are native deer mice, I'm going to take them outside and let them go. To release them you just pull up the lid and they're free. Come on. They've been in there all night and they don't know what to do. If you're new to my channel, please consider clicking the button right there. Currently, I'm posting videos every Monday, Thursday, and Saturday. So if you want to see how to catch mice, rats, squirrels, chipmunks, moles, voles, and gophers, stay tuned.